let's go over to Phantom. Phantom also losing areas of support, um, also in a downtrend. Um, nothing to see here except for Bollinger Bands and the Matic, or, and not Matic, and uh, Phantom is pushing them to the downside. You can see right around 25, 26 cents, it might try to hold some that area as support on this current downtrend. But again, with Bitcoin, it really depends on how long will Bitcoin go crabby to sideways, or, or sorry, crabby to down. Um, because if it's crabby to down, then you're going to see again that 20, remember, that 20 week moving average, right, for Bitcoin has not been breached yet. And these altcoins are already bleeding decently. If the 20-week uh, moving average is breached on Bitcoin, what do you think uh, is going to happen? A, these altcoins uh, slow down in their bleeding? Probably not. B, um, they basically um, bleed as much as they have been? Very likely. C, they bleed more? Highly likely, right? So uh, again, just be very careful here and, and you know, dollar cost average, but um, be ready for better buy opportunities around the corner. And again, you know, I would say in about one week's time, right, um, that's a good time to check in on that again to see, okay, are we trying to form a cycle low or not? And how likely is that? Um, so that's Phantom for you. Let's go over to our, you know, so going to get cheaper, right? So story for Maddox, story to Phantom, probably